We decided to record a documented series of the Nez Perce Indians. This is their story. This is how it began. As you can see here, we have a group of Nez Perce women hunting in their homeland, the Black Hills of Dakota. I'm not quite sure what they're hunting for, but they look intent on finding it. Oh, it appears they've caught something. Oh my goodness. Are you seeing this? This is amazing. They've got a deer. A deer they have killed. Oh my goodness. Look at the antlers on that deer. Uh, it appears they are skinning the deer now. Uh, it appears they... Oh my goodness. This is just a marvelous act. As you can see here, this one's cutting off something. Um, I, just words cannot describe how beautiful this scene is. Oh no, it seems some miners have come upon the Nez Perce land. I hope they do not discover gold. That will only start a gold rush and make the Nez Perce more angry at trespassers like hey, these. Hey, hey, what do you think you're doing here? It appears they found him. The government granted us this land once they forced us off our own. Get out of here! Oh, that threat from the woman Nez Perce was very scary. He looks very angry. We pulled aside some Native Americans for this special documentary. We asked them how it felt to have white intruders upon their land. Many moons ago, I saw these people coming and I knew they were bad news. They f***ed our land up. <sighs> really is lonesome up out in there. Ooh, nothing to do but look at trees and whatnot. Those trees are very pretty. They are very pretty. I wish we had trees where we were from. America. The greatest country on earth. America! Is that a civilian? It is. He comes here now. State your business. There's gold on Indian land, sir. The Indians won't let us have it. We'll have to make them an offer they cannot refuse. The Indians meet with General Custer in order to come to an agreement. I understand you want to speak to me about the terms of owning my land. Why, yes, I do, crazy ass. It's crazy horse. Uh, tomato, tomato. Crazy horse. Well, um, as you can see here, I noticed you have a lot of sacred burial. I know, it's chains very sacred. Life. And I was wondering, how much do you want for your land? Um, well, I've actually talked to my people about this, and we've come to the agreement of $6 million. Oh, $6 million. That's a little bit disgraceful. I understand but that, but it's a beautiful piece of land. It is. I have two pine cones, if you're willing um, to take the pine cones. Yeah, no. It's not going to work, so. Oh. Yeah, it's not going to work. Okay, well. I guess we'll have to come and get the land ourselves. Yeah, I guess so. You can bring it on, bitch. This means war. Alright, bro. <laughs> Custard and his right hand man preparing for battle. So the Native Americans realized that Custer and his men were ready for war, so they began to ask their ancestors for strength and power to win the fight with Custer. Ready, men? Charge! <laughs> <laughs> Get on the ground! Oh. Oh, no. oh. Oh. Jesus! Oh.